Hi Jilly, another lovely viewers as well. Let's talk about how we've made it to summertime. year, at least in my part of the world and lots of this part of the world and surrounding areas, there were a lot of snow days, um, making it seem like it would never be summer. No, and I was just like getting to the point where I thought it's never going to get here. But here it is. And I'm like, what do I do? Don't get me wrong. I mean, I frequently talk about how I'm an only child and like I can keep myself entertained. I never get bored. I could basically sit and stare at the wall and still be fine. Um, but these first two days of summer, I was kind of like, what? what is happening? I can do whatever. Because last summer, you know, I had London and they even had a conference in San Antonio. So like I had like certain dates. I knew I was going to do things by and now I'm just like, oh, vast. M months ahead of me? What? Just initially to ease into summer, I've been watching some Doctor Who on Netflix, and then of course last night I went and saw The Fault in Our Stars, but I am not emotionally ready to talk about that yet, so let's save that for maybe next week. Uh, speaking of future videos, as you may or may not know, if you've been along uh, for the ride for a while, uh, in the summer I try to make two videos a week, so hoping for the same as last year when it was like a Monday, Thursday, no promises, but that's what I'm hoping. Uh, and at some point we gotta make frozen bananas, you know this. So important question, what should be the first book that I start reading for the summer? I just finished rereading Anna and the French Kiss because I just thought that would be a perfect end of the school year, makes you happy, keeps you calm, uh, sort of book, but now I'm like, what do I read next? I'm either thinking, this, these are your choices, um, rereading for the umpteenth time, one of the Harry Potters, not necessarily in order, or Rebel Bell, which Katie, Strange Mango, Vincent Van Stop, uh, talked about the other day and made it seem super interesting. So let me know what you think I should do. Are we still in reread mode? Or are we ready for something new because it's summer? I leave it up to you. I don't know what to choose. You have until Monday. All right, Jilly and other lovely viewers as well. I will talk to you later. Bye.